You see that? That's what we're looking at today. I just can't get enough of this place, guys. I can't get enough of the streets. I can't get enough of the sidewalks. I can't get enough of the pool, the hot tub. I can't get enough of the weight room, the house itself, the townhome itself. If you're looking to move to Bricktown, Oklahoma, and you wanna live in one of the best locations in Bricktown of Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, this is the video you guys are gonna to wanna to stick around to. I'm gonna tell you everything about the location. I'm gonna tell you everything about the unit that's available for sale. And we're gonna look at everything that comes with living at the hill in Bricktown. All right, guys, let's get into the video right now. I wanna point out exactly where this amazing property is in Oklahoma City, guys. We're talking walking distance to the OU Health Science Center. We're talking walking distance to the Bricktown ballpark. We're talking walking distance to downtown Oklahoma City. That's downtown Oklahoma City right there. We're talking one of the most amazing properties in all of Oklahoma City that's a townhome. I can't wait to show you this home. I can't wait to show you the garage. I can't wait to show you everything that comes with it. You're gonna fall in love with this house and hopefully you call us right away so you don't miss out on this amazing opportunity. Look at that. Look at that covered entryway. That covered entryway. Does, did, man, wow. That's all I can say is wow. Let's go take a look inside. Can you believe this place? The location is amazing. I can't believe the location. But when we're talking about the place itself, you've got the living and kitchen downstairs with the bedrooms upstairs. Let's go ahead and talk about the main floor living area and then we'll go upstairs. I'm gonna blow you away by the bedrooms. If you're wanting a place with space downtown in Bricktown, Oklahoma, you guys are absolutely gonna fall in love with this living room, guys. This living room is huge. I could probably put one of those pianos over there by the window, have the giant TV on the wall, the couches along this side right here. This living room has a ton of space. So if you're looking for a huge living room to be able to relax when you come home at the end of the day, when you walk home at the end of the day, or you could drive home too. It's got a two car garage that we're gonna look at and it's got curbside parking, which is amazing. This living room is something you're gonna wanna check out in person. Do you guys enjoy cooking? Do you enjoy cooking? Does your spouse enjoy cooking? If you enjoy cooking, I love the fact that I can do the dishes right here, still be part of the conversation in the living room, be able to access the fridge, access all the countertops, access all the cabinets, and cook everything on a gas stove, guys. If you've never used a gas stove before, you're gonna love it. You're gonna, especially in the winter time, you're gonna love using a gas stove because it heats up the whole house. It's amazing. So let's go ahead and take a look at the garage first or do you wanna look at the bedrooms first? What do you wanna look at first? Comment down below what you wanna look at first and then maybe you'll guess the one that we look at first correctly. Maybe, go ahead, comment down below. I'll wait, I'll wait. Real quick comment, upstairs, garage. I'd really like to know what do you guys prefer to look at first? All right, let's go. As you can see, this house has so much natural lighting. So much natural lighting, guys. You've got the sun, uh, God, I forgot the name of it, moon roof. That's what it's called on a car. What is it called on the roof of a house? I just forgot the name of a window that's on the roof of the house. That's, that's hilarious, I can't believe that. But check out all of the giant baseboards Check out the attention to detail when it comes to the woodwork. Look at these railings, guys. These feel like iron railings. These are amazing. You guys wanna see the back patio or you wanna see the primary suite first? What do you wanna see? Let's go ahead and take a look at the primary suite. All right, this primary suite is huge, guys. It's huge. And your view is the city 
skyline. The view is the city skyline. Can you guys see that through the camera? Let me check real quick. That's the view from your, live, from your primary suite. So imagine waking up every morning, coming over, let's, let's imagine uh, curtains here, not, not blinds, throwing open your curtains, literally throwing your curtains open and being like, ah, I'm ready to conquer the day. That's what you get in these townhomes at the brick. If you're calling me, if you're reaching out to us after this video has been live two, three weeks, guys, the property may already be, been, be gone. The property may already be sold under contract. You can get this huge two bed town home, guys, under $500,000. Under $500,000 in downtown OKC, walking distance to the Harkins Theater, walking distance to the Riverwalk, walking distance to all the restaurants and things to do downtown, the Mirrored Gardens, the Scissor Tail Park, you can walk to the OU Health Science Center underneath $500,000, an amazing two bed, two living room, townhome with a two car garage. And we haven't even gone over the rec facility yet. Guys, this place is a place to fall in love with, especially if you're looking to live downtown in Oklahoma City at the brick in the Bricktown area of the Oklahoma City metro area. Check out this primary suite closet. Look at all these built-ins. You do not need a dresser. You do not need storage with all these built-ins. This place is amazing. It even has a pull-out laundry basket. Look at this. Look at that. A pull-out laundry basket with a shoe cubby galore. Do you want to see the primary suites bathroom? Check out that bathroom, guys. Huge jacuzzi tub. Huge walk-in shower, like that's a shower that they use in movies. That shower is huge, guys, look at it. That's like a six-person shower, that thing's huge. You got your double sink vanity right here, tons of storage, and then you've got your private reading room back there. I can't turn the light on because the fan is so powerful, you wouldn't be able to hear me talk. But look at that jacuzzi. This primary suite bathroom is amazing. Just look at that shower reading room, and jacuzzi tub. Living at the hill in Bricktown, Oklahoma is awesome. And you're gonna love the location. I can't get over the location enough. Check out the laundry room, guys. Is that not a great size laundry room? Look at that. Those are giant washers and dryers. Easy throw in all of your load. And here is the guest bath upstairs. There's also a half bath slash powder room downstairs. Look how far up all that tile goes. That tile goes way up there. That is awesome. And the attention to detail in the woodwork and everything else in this house has just been mind blowing. Look at this little study area in the back. So you could have an upstairs reading room, upstairs study area. And yes, we're gonna look at that back patio. You guys are gonna love that back patio. Here's the second bedroom in your new home, the hill at Bricktown. And then look at the closet in this secondary bedroom. Even the closet in the secondary bedroom has tons of storage area. Let's go look at the patio together. So if you're a prankster like me, right over here, right over here is the garage. You can't see it. Okay, now, right over here is the garage. You can't see it. But if you're a prankster like me, your spouse or loved one, whenever they're coming home, water balloons. Am I right? You could toss water balloons at them. How fun would that be? Unless they are a little butt hurt about practical jokes like that, you wouldn't want to toss water balloons at them. But if they don't get butt hurt over stuff like that, then yes, you want to toss water balloons at them. That would be funny. That would be funny. Making sure I got the door locked. Let's go take a look at the garage together. All right, get ready to show you the garage. As you can see, I'm in the garage. But yes, this is Oklahoma. Yes, we do get tornadoes, but what is that right there? Yep, it's your tornado shelter. So you've already got one, you're like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so scared of tornadoes living downtown in a townhome. Don't worry, 
you've got a tornado shelter. And then check out this garage. What I wanna point out about this garage, guys, is look how much room you have on the sides of the garage. You have enough room to put your recycling bin and your trash can. So plenty of room to open up your doors to your cars very easily and get out of your cars when you're in the garage. And then you've got this nice little curb thingy right here. Don't, don't take my word for it. You have to verify this on your own, but you can kind of pull up to that curb to know when to stop. You, you kind of could, but you have to verify that on your own. Don't just go do that because I said to. I don't, I don't claim any liability to you running your new car through your, through your wall. You've got to verify that on your own. Let's go take a look at the swimming pool and the clubhouse. I just love coming out of this house. Look at that. Let's go conquer the world together. Let's go do this. This street is awesome. This street is awesome. Look at all this parking. Look at all this parking. That is amazing. Let's go look at the clubhouse together. Like I was saying earlier, right down there, Harkins Theater, right down there, the ballpark, uh, just in front of the, Dev the Devon Tower, right over there, You've got the Mirrored Gardens. You've got the Cox Conventional Center. You've got the Thunder uh, Basketball. All within walking distance of being downtown, guys. This is an amazing location if you want to live in the urban area, in the city living urban area of Bricktown of Oklahoma City, guys. There's not a better location to live in when you're down here in Bricktown. Let's go find the clubhouse. And some of the things to think about when you're living in the the hill at Bricktown of Oklahoma City, guys, is you've got these beautiful sidewalks. I mean, you've got these amazing curves. I mean, this this area. I'm here in the middle of the day on a Monday, and it's just so peaceful. It's just so peaceful, guys. All your neighbors have beautiful little things out on their patios. You got people playing with chalk on the sidewalks. Isn't that amazing? Come on. Thumbs up, thumbs up if you got people playing with chalk on your sidewalks. That's the type of city you wanna live in, right? A city where they respect law and order. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. And then check it out over here. You've got the awesome, awesome clubhouse right here, guys. Is this not amazing? This is absolutely amazing. This is why people love this place, guys. Check this out. And I don't know if the audio is coming through on it, but that is a rainfall, guys. That is a rainfall. Look at the water doing the splash up. This is amazing. This is absolutely why you gotta give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email. You're gonna fall in love with this place. If not for the, if not for every single thing that I've mentioned already, but check this out and let's go look on the other side of it. Yes, that's a giant hot tub. That is a giant hot tub. So not only do you have this giant pool, but you've got this giant hot tub that you can relax in. Look at all of that seating. Look at all of that swimming. And then look at this hot tub, guys. Look at this rainfall right here. This is amazing. Living in the hill at the brick town is absolutely amazing. Let's go check out the clubhouse. All right, let's go check out the clubhouse together. Entryway right here. Oh my goodness, it is so cold in here, guys. After coming in from that pool, you better wrap up, because when you come in here, it is freezing. You got your restrooms right over here. You've got this entryway lobby area right here with your gym back there, your lounge over here, and you've got a full kitchen right here, full kitchen. Let's go take a look at the gym together. Conference room for board meetings. Now, I'm sure you gotta rent those out. Conference room for board meetings. Yes, look at this. Right now, it's 3.30 on a Monday. I've got this whole place to myself. This is basically your private gym because no one is in it. You've got treadmills. You've got a row machine. You've got an ecl eclipse. Ellipser, ellipse. <laughs> You've got one of those ski days. You've got one of those cable machines that can go to every single direction. Guys, let me show you what's right behind you. Yes, you've got.
got your own little area to work out in front of the mirror with the dumbbells. You've got all the dumbbells all the way up, guys, to 75 pounds. Dumbbells all the way up to 75 pounds. You've got every kettlebell that you can think of up to, up to 30 pounds. You've got those weighted balls that go up to 20 pounds if you want to do some weighted ball exercises. This gym, no one's in it. Three o'clock, two TVs, four sets of mirrors. One, two, three, four sets of mirrors, all yours. Not only do you get the amazing two bed, two living room, two car garage townhome that I was showing you when you buy this property. Not only do you get the amazing swimming pool with hot tub when you buy this property, but you get your own almost personal gym. Like there's no one in it is what I mean by that. Like you have to share it with other residents, but you get this gym to, for your disposal a clubhouse with a conference room, a, a clubhouse with a giant lobby, with a giant meeting room. Guys, living at the hill of Bricktown should be at the top of your list so far. Are you falling in love yet? Let's take a look at the kitchen. So when you're whining and dining your friends on the back patio with giant cookout area, back patio, covered area, you can just sit here and relax, two different grills, little fireplace, decorative fireplace over there. You've got the kitchen to prep your food. You've got your dishwashers to wash your food. You've got your 60-40 sink. This is the clubhouse to enjoy, to enjoy the back patio, the entryway lobby, or this giant, giant gathering room. Have you ever been on an African safari? Have you ever been to a giant club in Singapore, guys, you can have what's just like that, that you see on all the Indiana Jones movies, you can have access to, when you're living in the hill at Bricktown, guys. Look at that ceiling, look at these fans, look at that giant TV, look at all this space. Kids parties, business parties, work parties, just a bunch of friends getting together parties, guys. What the hill at Bricktown has to offer you for underneath $500,000, there's not another place in Oklahoma City like it. If you enjoyed today's video, I absolutely want you to subscribe to the channel. To see this property in person, I want you to give me a call, shoot me an email. The agents that I work with at HP Realty and I, we'd absolutely love to show you this home so that you can fall in love with it. If you're looking at this video two weeks, three weeks after it came out, guys, I'm sorry, this property may already be sold, but don't hesitate to give us a call. We'll be able to let you know if there's others available, and if there's nothing on the market, guys, we will literally call every single neighbor in the neighborhood that's not on the do not call list and ask them if they're thinking about moving. That's the type of service that we provide our buyers when they're moving to Bricktown in Oklahoma City. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, consider subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out on any of my new property tours. And guys, for all your real estate needs, give me a call, shoot me an email. We've got your back when moving to Oklahoma City. See you guys on the next one.